A Halton Catholic elementary school teacher is facing an alarming number of child pornography charges. 28 additional charges were laid against the 44-year-old male teacher who was originally arrested back in January. St. Anthony of Padua Catholic Elementary School in Milton is where the teacher was last employed. And that's where Sean Cowan is live with the details. Sean. Well, Taz, well, parents were actually here at the school today during class time for an unrelated event because it is Catholic Education Week. So I was able to catch up with some of them as they were leaving the school today and they were obviously disturbed. I, I feel disgusted I, and I'm worried about about everything, the whole situation in the school. Well, obviously it's concerning, right, uh, for the safety of the kids. Back in January of this year, 44-year-old Justin Zilke from Ancaster, who teaches in Halton, was arrested and charged with making and distributing child pornography. But today, Halton police say that same teacher is facing 28 additional charges, including luring, making, and obtaining sexual services from a minor. Uh, it's very concerning, obviously, and uh, my first thought is, were my children ever in this person's class or alone with them in the school? And we asked our children this, and, and they weren't, but they were also shocked to see that he wasn't there, and we explained to them um, in, you know, an appropriate way why the teacher is no longer at the school. Uh, like any other parent, I'm, I'm very much concerned. Um, but after that, I talked to my daughter right away because she was... I think um, the person involved was one of my daughter's uh, teachers, I believe, right? And um, and she said um, uh, she didn't um, notice anything suspicious. Halton police say the teacher had been luring children online from locations across the world. The accused recorded children performing sexual acts and would often pay them for doing so using gift cards from the popular online game Roblox. As, as a parent myself of, uh, of three young kids, it's you know it, it's horrifying to know that this sort of thing actually goes on in the world, right? So, but unfortunately, you know, situations like this make you realize that there are really bad people out there, right? And we have to protect our children. Halton police say the accused often used an online chat website called Omegle to target his victims and went by a variety of different names. I'll give you a couple tips. First one would be to pay attention to your. Uh, your children and their interactions with adults. So if you see anything that you think may be inappropriate or looks a little odd to you, um, follow your gut instinct on that, you know. Um, don't be afraid to, uh, to bring it up with your child or with the adult if you see something that you deem to be inappropriate, right? Because sometimes the, uh, the child or the youth may not know that the situation is, uh, has potential to become inappropriate. So just be aware of that and kind of pay attention to, uh, to your child and how they interact with, with older people. 44-year-old Justin Zilke was also a teacher at St. Vincent Elementary School and St. Matthew Elementary School, both in Oakville. But he's been teaching at St. Anthony of Padua in Milton since 2016. He has been in police custody since he was arrested in January. And the school board tells me that they have shared this news with the school community. They also tell me that there are supports available for both staff and students who may be struggling with this news.